In case I haven't told you in about the last 20 seconds, I love you. I love you almost as much as I love this cigar band. Well, don't ever say I didn't buy you nothing. Oh, I think that I'm going to have it bronzed so that nothing ever happens to it. Well, I should hope so. It set me back 10 cents. I'm going to hold you to it, you know. What? That promise of wearing your mother's wedding ring. Good. She'd like that. I wish you could have met her. You know what? It, it's kind of funny. When I, uh... I almost got married once before, and it was uh, to a girl named, uh... Jennifer? Je oh, that... J Jennifer? You sure? Jen? Okay, if you say so. A girl named Jennifer. Uh-huh. <laughs> but I never once considered giving her my mother's wedding ring. Ever. It was too important to me. That ring's been so important that I have saved it all my life for the woman who I was going to spend the rest of my life with, and that's you, and you know it. I do. I do. We're going to have a wonderful life. Oh, beautiful life. Even if we have to eat crackers and stale donuts. We'll be together. Yeah, that'll be nice. That's all I need. Now, baby, just like this is how we're going into that police station. We'll hold each other's hands and be together all the way, and I will not let your hands go. I know you won't. Afraid? Yeah. A little, but I'm going to be all right. I'll be all right, just as long as you won't let go of my hands. I promise I won't. We'll face whatever it is. And we'll beat it. We'll be together. Okay. That's all I need to hear. We've won, you know. <laughs> we did win. <laughs> We're not heroes or anything like that, but we won. I know Smith and all his little playmates are going to go to prison. Mm -hmm. They're going to get sent up the river, as they say, right? And we are going to have a future together. All the way together. Right. Would you say the words? What words? The words. The what? word. Come on, girl, the words. What words? The wedding vow, the ceremony. Could you say that for me? I, Laura, take thee, Luke. I, Laura, take thee, Luke. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. <laughs> for better or for worse. For better or for worse. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. I believe you. I feel very strong with this ring on. Good. This afternoon, keep a hold of it. Don't lose the ring, baby. And we'll be able to answer the questions. We'll be able to face those funny looks or whatever. Just hold on to that ring and know how much I love you, okay? And we are married, aren't we? I mean, mm -hmm. we're married. Do you feel married to me? Yeah. You do? I do. You do? Really? I do. <laughs> oh, here's the food. Excuse me. Are you hungry? I'm starved. <laughs> Good. Terrific. Thank you. Anything else? Uh, yeah. Um, it, well, uh, you know, you have to excuse us. We're, we're a little bit uh, confused here because, you see, we just got married. Yeah, we did. We did. We would like some crackers and stale donuts, however, to go. Sure, right? anything you say. Right. But no kidding. Yeah, we got married. Let me just... see right. Yeah. Well, come on, it's a promissory note. What do you want? I mean, I'm going to give her the real thing as soon as we find a minister, and, you know, we'll do it right. Do you mind? There's a big tip in it for you, if it's okay with you. Oh, um, I'd like some uh, ketchup for my french fries, please. Yeah, the soul of romance here. Yeah, yeah, he's the poet in the family. I'm just, um, I'm hungry all the time. <laughs> Ich bin wieder zurück, Jesse. Das war ja eine kurze Mittagspause. Ich möchte wieder zu meinem Patienten. Wir haben ja einen richtigen Schock bekommen, als wir erfahren hatten, wer ihr Patient ist. 
Und wie Rick erst zumute gewesen ist, als er gehört hatte, dass dieser Mann seine Tochter umbringen wollte. Rick hat vorhin angerufen und gesagt, dass ein Hutch wieder zu sich kommt und er bei ihm bleibt, bis sie zurück sind. Ja, deshalb gehe ich jetzt nach oben und löse ihn ab, damit er ins Polizeipräsidium gehen kann. Er möchte da sein, wenn Laura ankommt. Wir haben noch nichts gehört. Ich glaube, es dauert noch eine Weile. Oh, es tut mir übrigens leid, dass es so hochgespielt worden ist. Meinen Sie in der Zeitung? Oh ja, in der Spätausgabe. Tatsächlich? Ja, Ach, die Presse hat ihr gefundenes Fressen mit dem Skandal um Frank Smith. Die Verhaftung von Frank Smith erschüttert das General Hospital. Ach du liebe Zeit, hoffentlich sind Luke und Laura darauf vorbereitet, wenn sie plötzlich so vielen Reportern gegenüberstehen. Und Fug. Ich hoffe... Ich hoffe, dass sie sich nicht mehr verletzt haben. Ich weiß, was es ihnen passiert. Ich glaube, sie werden ihnen besser zeigen, dass sie sich verletzt haben. Es ist besser. Bis später. I'm checking out now. I'm uh, on my way to police headquarters. All right. And is there any word about the board meeting? Not a thing. Yes, I'll have to go by myself. At least to tie up. Here he is now. Oh, God. Oh, How did he go? Well, I'll tell you about it later. Um, what I want to know now is you talk to Scotty. Briefly. Very briefly. And? I told him that Laura was arriving today when I asked him if he'd like to come with us, and he said, no way.
except um, I'm only half married. What? What do you mean? My husband didn't say his marriage vows. What do you want from me? The food came in in the middle of the ceremony. Yeah, well, you're done eating now. Oh, boy. All right. I, Luke, take thee, Laura, as my lawfully wedded wife. In sickness and in health, for better or for worse, to love, honor, protect, and cherish all the days of our lives till death do us part. Thank you. No ceremony in the world could seem more real to me, Laura. Or to me. So we got a whole future out there waiting for us. Hope it's not as fragile as his wedding band. You, uh, still like to just run out the door and keep running, right? Me too. Then let's do it. Shall we? Yes, let's do it. We can. Right now? Let's kiss. Where will we go? I don't know where we can go. <laughs> we can probably sneak out right now. Let's do it. Baby, whoa, whoa, whoa. Do you love me? You know I do. Then we're not gonna run, are we? Mrs. Luke Spencer does not run. She holds her head up high. And we walk out together and we face whatever it is out there. Don't we? Just don't let go of my hand. No way, baby. No way. Get that ring to remind you. We've had a ceremony here that's very important. And I'm with you. There's no way. Let you go. Yeah, as soon as I uh, pay the bill. <clears throat> Looks like that uh, Frank Smith arrest is hitting a lot of people. Yeah, including General Hospital. Mm -hmm. Can I see that? Sure. What is it, Lauren? We'll be out in a second, all right? Sure. Mm -hmm. Come here. Come on. Hang on. Mrs. Spencer. Don't worry about reporters or nothing. Just hang on. Come on, baby. Let's go face the lions. Come. Okay, Doctor. Ich werde es ausrichten. Ja, gut. Auf Wiederhören. Habt ihr schon... Have you seen them? Certainly have. It's all full of Frank Smith in the hospital. And there was a man brought in with a bullet in his heart. Joe Kelly said he was a hitman. I know it's all true, but I just still can't believe everything that's happened. I understand the board of directors is really raising the roof. Is Steve still in there with him? As far as I know, so is Dan. I haven't seen either one of them. Gail and Lee went down to the police station. Well, what about Scotty? We don't know anything. Like I don't think he's going to go down. Well, it certainly is an awkward situation, all right. To say the least. Yeah. Here comes Steve now. Right here. You look tired. Beat. Jesse, how's that surgery coming along with Rick and Monica? So far, so good. Uh, is Dan still in the boardroom? Oh, yeah, yeah. And he's giving the board a rough time. I have to hand it to Dan. He fights like a real tiger. How's it going for you? Not good. Come on, let's go over and sit down for a minute, huh? Oh, I hate it when you have to tackle with that board. It's a real rough one this time, Audrey. Steve, it's uh, in the newspapers. Already? About Frank Smith? Mm -hmm. And about the hospital, too. Oh, no. Our general rated a headline. Well, it's bad enough with the board already. Wait till I see the papers. Well, what is it they want? Blood. Oh, they always react this way at first. It's my blood they want this time. Do you know what a couple of them asked me, talked about? That I knew the real truth about Frank Smith all along. Oh, are you joking? Dead serious, Audrey. 
They must be out of their minds. They suggested that I probably kept quiet to see my lifelong dream come true. The teaching wing, no matter how I got the money. How dare they? Oh, indeed. Anyway, I turned in my resignations. 